Hello everyone, my name is Brian De Silva and I work with the BMC Tracker Technical Support Team. In this video tutorial, I'm going to show you how to restore the backup that was created in part 1 video tutorial of how to move, copy or move, track it from one server to another. So for this we'll require the copy or move batch file downloaded from the article 9955. We will also require to install the same version of track it on the new server. So let's get started. As you can see, I'm on the old Windows Server 2008 server where my backup has been created. I'm going to copy this backup to the new server location, which will be the C$, which is program files x86, PMC software, track it, track it server, backup. And place the file over here. So once the file has been copied, let's log into the new server, which will be my Windows Server 2012 R2 Standard Edition server. So here's my new server, and as you can see, this is the backup set that I've copied from the old server, and this is the path where you need to copy the backup. Then go ahead and delete the trial data.pak file which is in there. Next, I'm going to close the window and run the copy move batch file as an administrator. Press any key to continue. Press R for restore. Then press any key to continue. So since I'm moving the entire application and the database to this server, I'm going to press O for this one. I then type the username as SA. This will depend on the installation at your end. If you have a full version of SQL, make sure you have these credentials before you run the restore. So by default, the credentials are SA and the password is displayed on the screen. We then need to specify a new name of the Dragon database. Then press any key to continue. So as you can see the restore has been completed. Press any key to continue. Next, log into the technician client to see if the database has been restored successfully and verify all the configurations have been restored as well. As you can see, I have reached the database over here and let's check the configurations. And we also have this configurations copied from the old server. Post restore instructions. So if the Tracket web was installed on the old server, make sure you uninstall it. Or if you want to keep this web on the same server, make sure you reinstall it. This time, make sure you are pointing it to the new Tracker server location share. Or you can simply opt to install it fresh on the new server or on another dedicated web server. Next, make sure you uninstall the Tracker technician client on your workstations and reinstall them from the new Tracker server share. Also, make sure to disable the Tracker service management service on the old server or completely uninstall track it from the old server. I hope this video was helpful in restoring track it from one server to another. Thank you.